Hello ladies, welcome to Faith and Fashion by Natasha's Thread. Today is March 10th, 2021, and I want to inspire you with a word today called capacity. Do you have the capacity to walk into what you are believing for and what you are praying for? You do, but what you need to do is prepare for the thing that you are believing or praying for. I want to give you a quick passage. It's in the book of Isaiah, Isaiah 54. You can read the whole passage at your own time. This is talking about the future glory of Jerusalem. And so the prophet Isaiah is telling a people that they need to worship pretty much. Remember, I always paraphrase. So they need to worship their way out of their barrenness because he sees them and he uses you know a pregnant woman as a sample that you uh well a bear a, a woman that who has suffered barrenness as an example but how she will have more children than the other that meaning that she will produce right and so if you read later on in the passage the second part of the passage which i love he is telling them how to prepare that they're to stretch forth their stakes that they are to put stakes in the ground there to expand their housing meaning expand their capacity so that is my word for you worship your way into where you want to be where you're going into your goals worship god of course and then you will start producing you will start birthing you will start to see fruit in your life and then the second part prepare make pre preparation for what you're believing for even though it's not there yet so you can start to do stuff so when it when that thing happens you are already have your your platforms your your positioning in place you already have what you need because you purchased this you did that you moved here you um jumped up you took a step of faith and you network and you met this person who can connect you with that person to get your your tech into place or whatever it is you got you have to prepare you have to make preparation you need order in your vision so you can start to do it now you don't have to wait until it is fully manifested as we would say so once again that's fine that the passage if you want to study or read it is fine found in the book of isaiah isaiah 54 you're preparing for your future glory your future dream your future outcome and your future to blossom the way that you want it to be because you are putting your stakes in the ground and you're doing what you need to do and you also are worshiping God which is the number one thing you should be doing so that you can bear fruit at all times okay let's talk about my outfit today I wore an oversized suit I love it the jacket is really oversized and um, I put on a shirt, a collar shirt with some um, patterns in it to pop out the suit. I love it. And I have some silver metallic mules to give the outfit or more of a pop. And I'm going to wear my pale pink crossover purse to wear with it. I love, I love. And because I'm going out today when I go out, because it will be 70 degrees here in Atlanta um, this afternoon, I'm going to wear these pink shades. And there we are. There I have my outfit. I'm ready to start my day. I'm ready to walk in a room like what we're going to do. Let's do business. Okay. So. If you need some help in your wardrobe, I would love to help you. You can email me at info at natashasthreads.com. Sorry, my hair is... Anyway, info at natashasthreads.com. That's info, I-N-F-O, Natasha's N-A-T-A-S-H-A-S, threads, T-H-R-E-A-D-S.com. And I would love to book you a style consultation or a style session, or a wardrobe makeover. Let's get you on the book so that as you expand your capacity to believe what you are asking for, you are going to look good doing it. See you next time.